If you'd like to support the channel, check out the links on our homepage. We now have a Patreon account where you can support the channel and you'll get extra content and battle reports. We have a coffee account where you can make one-off donations. You can check out our Instagram for all the channel going-ons and our Goblin Gaming affiliate link where they sell Games Workshop, all kinds of hobby and of course Adeptus Titanicus at reduced rates. Anything you buy using the link, the channel gets a little back in return. And last but not least, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much and enjoy the show. Hello Princeps and today I thought I would do a short video on how I magnetise the shoulder weapons for my Warmaster. Now the reason I didn't video this when I was doing it is because assembly is not my strong point and uh, I wasn't sure this was going to work. I've seen a few different methods and um, this required not a lot of work, not many magnets. Uh, I thought it was quite simple and it did work. So uh, let's have a look. So you can see on my Warmaster, I've got the uh, missiles in the shoulders there, which are fully magnetized and interchangeable with all the others. So how did I do it? Let's have a look. So the first thing I do is take off the arms, because they just get in the way. Okay, so let's pop these out. One there, and one there, okay. So they're out. So inside there, I drilled a small hole and I put a 3 by one magnet recessed in the middle. Okay. Then you've got the mount for the, all the other weapons. And what I did, I drilled through the back, bored out the square uh, rectangle bit in the front, and I put in a 5 by 3 magnet right through the middle. Okay, and you can see it doesn't go all the way through, it stops just short. And then there I've got another 3 by 1 magnet. And what I've done is on the back of the weapons, I've put 3 by 1s. Basically, they just go together like that. And then the whole thing goes into the shoulder. And then what you can do is you can change the weapons, but keep the mount in. There you go, simple, like that. Okay. Then when you want to put the missiles back in, you take out the mount. And what I did with these is I just filled the back with green stuff. Not tidy, and I shoved another uh, one of the 5 by 3 magnets as far as it needed to go and then they just pop in there so I literally needed two types of magnet I needed enough 3 by ones to mount the back of each weapon that's literally filed off the nub and glued on the back um, I needed two to go in the recess here and then I needed the the big ones there, the five by threes, just to go through the middle of these. So there you go, all you need is some three by ones and some three by fives. Everything's fully interchangeable. Just like so. So I hope that's helped you out, nice and easy I thought, and uh, gets all those guns on board for your Warmasters. So thanks very much Princeps, and I will see you in the next video.